Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Harrods Garage. In this episode, we're going to be continuing on with the fog light intake. So as you can see, we have the gel coat on. So what we need to do is get some fog glass on there and then put some resin on and let it set. In this episode, we're going to be doing that and we're also going to be popping it out of the mold. So stay tuned for that. Alright guys, I need to chop some of this up for... Ooh, magic, it moved. Um, for this. So I'm going to trim off these bits here so we can have five glass going straight down. And make it a bit easier for us. Um, yeah, and I'll prop it back up. Just move that for a different video. Which is coming up this week. So yeah. I'll fix that. Alright guys, just chopped up some different length, different size. This one's to go over the full thing and it'll uh, go in there as well. So that'll probably be my last piece I put on. Not too fast being a mould. If it was a piece, I'd make it a lot neater. Make it obviously a lot more even. So I'd probably do three or four of these and make it perfect. But yeah, just a mould. So we're going to mix up some resin now. And put a little bit of resin on, and then we'll start putting on the uh, the fiber, the chop mat. Alright guys, just finished up laying up the fiberglass, gotta wait for that to dry, um, you guys don't have to wait, it's going to be in the next clip, but we're going to start filming something else that you guys will kind of see tomorrow, so a new series is coming out, stay tuned for that, but coming right up, we'll be popping this out. Also, unfortunately, um, tomorrow's episode will not actually be the compound setup. I do need the Forester for a little bit longer 
so that will be coming up guys um, so don't worry about that um, might be about a month or so away guys but some exciting things are coming alright guys it's the next day time to uh, get this out hopefully it's an easy one to get out By the looks of it, new. So, I've actually had some of the um, the resin go under, so it's locked in. This is going to need to be trimmed before I even get it out. So I'm just going to quickly head out the back, get my mask on, and get the angle grinder and grind it down. So it should be easy to pop out. Alright, I'm back and I can't see because it's so bright outside. Um, let's trim it down a bit. Let's, uh, let's see how we go. I'll trim it down more. Alright, let's try that again. And once again, I cannot see because it's so bright outside. So, use an angle grinder. Just grind down until I saw the blue PVA. So, it should be a lot easier. Needs a little bit of work. But she's looking good. I've still got that lip, so I haven't still got room to play with. I'm gonna have to fill that in and put a bit of resin down in there. So what I'll do is I'll um, put some tape, tape around it. Hopefully it doesn't seep in and uh, yeah, I'll just fill them up so it's stronger. Yeah, it's the intake mould. So once I fill them in, I'll do that off camera, it's boring stuff. Um, we'll be able to produce my first intake, cold air intake for a SF5. SDI front bumper. Sweet. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned. Uh, got a different series coming up for the month of November. So, thanks for watching. Catch you next time. Bye.